Hey guys. Hey. The boys and I woke up first thing this morning. We are headed to Sparta, Tennessee to meet a, a new tour sponsor of ours, Orion Coolers. They're one of the only cooler manufacturers that are manufactured entirely in the United States, right here in Tennessee. They also make Jackson kayaks. Uh, we're supposed to get kind of a beginner's course on how to use these kayaks. One of my dear friends from high school, Eric Boomer, he's one of the world's most elite kayakers. He also uses Jackson kayaks, and at some point he's offering us a uh, kayak course with him in Idaho. But before we end up with him in Idaho drowning somewhere, we figured we'd train with the guys here in Sparta first. Have a great day enjoying American-made products, and uh, have a blast. The Shredneck Wave, baby, what's up? All right, we're here. Apparently we're at the uh, wrong address, the old factory, so we need to uh, get to the correct address, so mount up! Back in the sprinter. We're here in Sparta, Tennessee at the home of Jackson Kayak. My friend Ian, my friend Bridget, they're gonna show us how these are manufactured, made in America, right here. So most of the boats are gonna be a two-part mold, a top and a bottom. Um, things with uh, sit inside are gonna have a cockpit piece as well just to help form that rail. It's a soft aluminum on the inside. It looks like your Coke can. Really a sensitive material on the, out, on the inside. Your thumbnail can scratch it and dent it in. That's how sensitive the inside is. But on the outside though, it's a hard steel. This is one of the only pieces that of this entire process that we don't do in house. So we're gonna have this manufactured and then shipped to us. It comes from Texas normally. So most of what you're seeing today, we're gonna have made it here from the start all the way to the finish of it, so. Still American made folks, even the mold. Come on, let's go check out what it's actually gonna do in the oven. We're gonna make a kayak. Come on, guys. What JD's doing right now is he's prepping some areas. He's gonna go ahead and pre-pour some powder in some areas that we wanna build extra structure for. He's also gonna add some metal inserts. They're how we connect our grab handles and a few other parts. It's really a safer way of making boats. So once JD gets us ready, we'll go over there and pour our own yeah. boat. Yeah. All right. All right, let's do yeah, it. Yeah. Now that you guys are poured, JD's gonna get it all closed up. Here in a few minutes when this gets emptied out, they're gonna go ahead and put that in. Here in about 30 minutes or so, it'll be on the cooling rack. In about an hour and a half, your boat will be a boat. The USS Shredneck. Yeah! yeah. You gotta put that on there. <laughs> What do you do at this stand? At this stand, I grab the boats from the oven here, check them all out, make sure the uh, you know, plastic where it's supposed to be, and it's okay. where it's supposed to be, and then I cut it out. First okay. I do a pre-cut, and then I take the signature and put it on here, pre-cut, and then I cut it out. And then I'll sand it, shape it, grill it, magnet it, and set it off the building. Would you like to feel? This is before she does it, and that's after. Oh, before? And that's after. Oh. So that's the big difference between like a regular big box store kayak right, and a store you can feel there for uh, uh, like a racing bike to us. A little bit of labor goes a long way on what the finished product really is. So. Right. You know, to make something affordable, you normally have to buy 10,000 parts or something like that. We can make one mold and make this as we go. 
make two weeks worth at a time. Yeah, we're not sitting on shelves worth of material that we may or may not sell or use. Yeah. So for R and D, it's huge because we can design it here. We can go test it on the river we're about to go get on, yeah. see if it works. We're not shipping stuff back and forth. On the back end, it's it's, it's all recyclable again. On the front end, this is a like a recycled previously material. So again, really environmentally friendly. Time to try these out, guys. Let's get out on the water. Right on. paddle this way folks. That's what I've learned today. Uh, we know we want this facing back, kind of curved in. Oh, you're cool. You're it's way all back. Cas. It's all cast. That's right. Here. Let's go recording! <laughs> My phone's off! <laughs>